the, the frequency download that comes from them just by gazing upon them again, I think it has the same type of energy with what you see with this, with the structures that they make, because it, with this particular one, when I saw it for the first time, my friends, Kevin and Sandy, we were all, we're all camping and they were like, it was like day two of me being there and they're like, okay, well, you want to go see the structure? And I was like, yeah, you know, I've heard so much about it. Let's go check it out. We're over on this other side of the Creek. We come down and, and Sandy's like, it's just right over there. And I'm like, I'm trying to look. I'm like, I don't see it. I don't see it. She's like, just relax your eyes. I relaxed my eyes and then it popped out. I was like, holy shit. This is, I've never seen a structure like this. Like this is different. This is next level. We cross the little Creek. We get up to it. They had already seen it. This was my first time, but it wasn't their first time. I, I fell to my knees at the, at the base of like this doorway at the threshold of this doorway, I fell to my knees and, and, and just all this sadness that I had been holding on to through um, a lot of death and transitions and um, things that had been happening for a few years up until this point. And that like I had been working through, been very, very active in my healing, but I, I was still hurting and, and I was holding on to it. And I walked into that threshold and fell to my knees and just, it all came out and I just started crying and, and I felt this holding of me. I felt this hug, all encompassing hug as I'm on my knees inside of this structure and, and the loveliness of Kevin and Sandy of just standing there you know, just letting me have my moment. And it was 15, 20 minutes of me not being able to stop crying and just being inside of this and whatever that was, you know, frequency wise, energetic wise, a full, this is something that's experienced a lot by people who are going down this path and having these respectful con connections with the Sasquatch are these massive healings and also getting hit with what's called and being known as the love zap that you get hit with so much love. It's more than you've ever experienced in your life. And it will break your boundaries and just bring up everything. And you get flooded with love. And it's un, uh, like, I can't describe it except for that. And like, that's what all these people, other people who are finding themselves in these situations too, and having that connection with them they're, they're feeling the highest levels of love through their connection with the Sasquatch that they've ever had in their lives.